Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel. My name is Kelsey. If you're new here, I share beauty, fashion, and lifestyle. I share weekly vlogs with my husband and our new baby. We have a four month old baby girl at home. Uh, so I am newly postpartum. So I, a lot of my fashion content lately has been a little more like postpartum, trying to style my new postpartum body. So jeans have been a big struggle for me and it took me a while before I tried on my jeans and I was like, oh my gosh, these do not fit anymore. So. I'm just accepting the fact that I won't fit into my old jeans, which is totally fine. I have a new body and you have to accept the body that gave life. <laughs> and I did get a C-section as well, so I have a little bit of a C-section pooch there going on down there. Uh, so I wanted to try some new jeans and try to figure out what fits me now. <laughs> I figured out my size. I went in store recently and figured out my size. I am now a size 10 in most jeans, at least the ones that I've been trying. Um, and Abercrombie and American Eagle are the ones I've tried, and those are pretty standard sizes for me from my experience over the many years. I used to be a 6'8", and now I'm a 10. Maybe I'll get back down there, but right now I'm just accepting the fact that, you know, my body changed and that's probably how it's going to be for a little while and that's okay. So rather than getting down on myself, let's find a new pair of jeans that fits and I feel confident and good in. And I love the mom style jean that's going around or like the, you know, dad or mom style trends. And I got five pairs here to try on from Abercrombie. I did uh, share in a recent vlog one where I tried on an American Eagle pair of jeans. Honestly though, I think Abercrombie has a better quality jean as far as more flattering in the pooch area. So if you are new here, we would love to have you join our YouTube fam. Like I said, I share weekly vlogs with my husband and our baby girl. So we do a lot of lifestyle type stuff uh, weekly. And then I will do these fashion, beauty, lifestyle type videos here and there, more curated videos as well. So hit that subscribe button and that notification bell so you're notified each time a new video goes live. But without further ado, let's jump into trying these on because I need your help. Let's do it. All right, so these are the mom high-rise jeans. I have slippers on because you don't wanna see my toes. I got my toes done last when Layla was, before Layla was born, actually. Um, I think it was like six weeks before Layla was born. So we're not gonna show you my feet. But these are the mom high-rise. I have a little bit of a C-section pooch, but I am wearing my Spanx thong. They're un, I think they're called the undetectable underwear. I'll put them up here, a little screenshot. Uh, love them with these. Now for these pants though, they are a little bit snug in the size 10, but I was still able to get them on and once I got them on, I'm like, okay, I can do this. So if I keep up with my uh, workouts that I've been doing, I'm hoping this fits a little bit nicer. You can see there's like a little bit of a gap right here, but overall they look really nice and I love the wash of them. They're like a mix like just a standard like blue they're not too dark not too light have the distressing on them and then the hem at the bottom is slightly distressed as well and it hits above the ankle on me i think they have different lengths too uh, but here is the back you can see the spanx thong hanging out because it's this big piece right here and you can see a little bit of a pooch right here but this keeps everything pretty flat the zipper front here i love it and super comfortable mom jean. There they are. Sorry about my blinds over there. There's no curtains, so this is the blinds closed. We need, we're changing that up soon. All right, this next one is a very much an A Goldie dupe for sure. Way less expensive than the A Goldie as well. It has the buttons up the front, that like light wash there, and these are the dad high rise. I am also in a size 10 in these and since these button it doesn't quite show that little gap like with the uh, zipper and it keeps it nice and flat here as well. Comfortable when you sit. Hides the pooch a little bit and these ones are going to be a lot longer. See how long they go there? You can cuff them, do whatever. I feel like these will be really good in winter with boots and everything. So and with sneakers I feel like they're going to look really really cute too. Oh and then here's the back. Okay, the next ones are the ankle straight jeans, but I can't get them on. This is my, these are my Spanx, so that's not my skin. But you can see, way too tiny. So I would suggest sizing up one to even two sizes. I think one should be fine uh, based on like where your body type and where you want it to hit. My body, I don't think I mentioned this, but it's more like rectangle. It has, it slightly goes in a little here, but not, it's not more like the hourglass where it goes way in and then out. 
So it doesn't have much of a difference between my waist here and then my hips. So um, just keep that in mind as far as when you're shopping. But they're a little bit wider at the bottom as well. I took off my socks here and they're hiding. My toes are hiding in this faux fur rug. But uh, yeah, that's this one and the back. I really do like these, but obviously I would need a different size. So I think between this one though and the last one, is there a little chunk? Oh yeah, this is nice and ripped right there. Between this one and the last one uh, of the same wash, I would go with the, the other one. Okay, jumping in, it's several days later and I'm editing my video and I did a reel to go along with a video to show you how to style it. So I will link that down in the description. But I tried on these jeans, which were the, were they the second, no, the third pair and they didn't fit in that video. Well, they do fit. So I don't know if I just didn't pull them up high enough or what, but they fit just the same. These are the same style as the fourth pair and they fit just the same. So, so you can see a little bit of the gap right there, but I think I just needed to pull them up a little bit higher. I don't like these as much as the other ones and I don't love this rip here. It looks like it's supposed to be like that too. Um, but between this one and the other wash, I like the other wash better, but I still wanted to show these to you guys so that you know that the, um, that they are still true to size. So these are the ankle straight. I'll put the wash down below, but it'll have everything there. And I'm also putting together a blog post. So all of that'll be down in the description. So just wanted to show these. All right. I'm super glad I tried these on because this is literally the exact same jean as the one before. They're the ankle straight in the ultra high rise in the same size, but this size fits. So I don't know if it's just that wash or what, but I really like this wash even probably a little bit better. It's a little bit lighter, but not too light. Has a zipper, so it's nice and flat in the front. Good structure, distressing on the knees, and then uh, a little longer, but not too long in the ankle, and then super comfy in back. So at least you can see how the other one would fit if you sized up, but so confused. I don't know why their sizing is off like that, but these are super comfortable. I might have to keep these ones. Okay, so the, the last pair of jeans I had were the ex exact same ones, so I just had four to choose from. I like these, which are the lighter wash, or the first ones I tried on, which are a darker wash. So I'm between those two for sure, for like just a standard like regular jean, and then I think I like the dad jean as well, um, the more distressed, the A Goldie dupe ones. But I can't decide, I feel like these flare out a little bit more at the bottom. They're super comfy though, and stretchy, and I'm deciding between these and those. Uh, the very first one i'll put them on again but i don't know i don't know which one to choose i feel like i like the tapered that one has more of like a tapered in bottom and this one has more of a flare i'm gonna put it on we'll see here are the darker i think i like the distressing on the lighter ones a little bit better but i do like how these taper and aren't quite as wide ah decisions i need your guys's help deciding which ones to pick Hmm, I think I like the wash on the other ones, but I just, I don't think I have a darker pair. I'm gonna have to see. I have one other postpartum jean that I bought that might be similar to this, so I'm gonna have to compare. But let me know what you guys think down in the comments, which one your favorite is. I'll put them all real quick here again. I'll put, maybe I'll put some photos or video, quick video, but let me know which one you guys like. Okay, so I'm for sure keeping these. These are the dad high rise. I'm going to keep these, but I need your help in picking number one or number four. So the first one or the last one that I shared. Hmm, I really like these though. I definitely have to keep these. So if you're looking for ways to style these jeans, I actually shared a reel over on Instagram. If you're not following me on there, I am at Kelsey Christine. You can follow me over on there and it's going to be live over there when you're seeing this video. Leave a comment down below with your favorite. Thank you so much for watching and subscribe if you're not already subscribed. I share beauty, fashion, lifestyle. We do weekly vlogs with my new baby. She's four months old right now. So we got lots of content with her um, and just our everyday life. So come join our YouTube fam and then don't forget to follow along on Instagram. And I also share on TikTok. So thank you so much for watching and I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye.